hilarious. Come on, Norn. <laughs> Come on, Norn. Dude, he bit it all. Oh, oh my god. Oh. Oh. Mega, mega, mega. That's a pagan, bro. Yo, what's poppin', folks? Welcome to another video today. Guys, we got a banger because one, I got my boy fishing with Norm with me again. You guys are seeing them all the time now. And uh, Norm, we got a banger for the folks, man. Woo! Just a straight, straight up banger. You guys already know by the title, but if you guys are new to the channel, smash that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, like this video, and leave more comment suggestions down below. If you guys like the videos with Norm, leave some videos down below that you want me and this boy to film. So, and if you guys want to check out his channel, I'll link it down below. But today we're going to be doing a top water only bass fishing challenge. I was talking to Norm as we were driving to this first spot this morning. I was like, man, it's starting to get a little, like we're in this fall pattern. It's not chilly right now, but I want to get as many top water fish as I can before the end of the year because I don't want it to get too cold. I just love top water fishing. I think we all love top water fishing and that is the main goal so let me show you what baits we're going to be throwing today and i think it's going to be a good one man it's going to be a real good one smash that thumbs up man what are we doing are we looking for top water lures yeah. noah's truck yeah i think so norm i, I mean i was yeah. you see how you see how he started this i was going to say norm <laughs> what's your plan for your top water he's like oh let me just go scavenge in noah's truck real quick top water box at the house which uh, yeah. uh, typical norm move honestly By the way, if you guys want to check out some merch, guys, I got the hot merch on right now. This is just, this is fire. What do you think, Norm? You liking the shirt, it's man? Hot. It's, it's hot. It's hot, bro. Baby. It's hot, bro. Got the fishing poles, got the stars, the American flag on deck. If you guys want to check it out, I'll leave a link down below. It's 30% off. I really appreciate you guys supporting everybody who's been, you know, copping some of the merch, repping it around town. That is awesome. I'm, I'm all down about the movement, man, and spreading the word about, you know, catching fish, getting outside, going fishing, and repping the kicking their bass TV brand. That's what we're about over here. So everybody that does that, thank you so much. So Norm, what do you throw in for the old top water only challenge today? You're throwing a popper. Some sort of, I have no clue what type of popper this is. This is a Noah's truck special. I just found <laughs> it laying there. It's like, I'll throw this for my top water challenge. I love a popper though. Norm's got his braided combo. He actually has a spinning rod that yep. is the only braided combo he had. And honestly, one of the only top waters that'd be good on that rod would be probably the popper yeah and you're definitely going to get away with it and i think you're going to catch some big bass today this is going to be perfect that he's throwing the old popper because what i'm going to be throwing is completely different and it's going to add a great variety snake. to the challenge it's not a snake norm it is not a snake <laughs> i do have a snake on my rod um this is uh something i had on previously i'm going to film another video on the snake so stay tuned for that very soon i've actually filmed so many days i probably filmed five days of this thing and i haven't been able to get a video done so uh yeah we're going to be trying this thing out so stay tuned for that video i also have another video on it if you want to check it out but what i'm throwing today i got very sexy bait today this is the mag dog 130 i'm just going to show you guys this is by six cents like i said if you guys want discounts on it just if you want to if you're interested down below on the screen look at this bad boy right here mm -mm -mm -mm. what do you think about that homie that pretty pretty what you, pretty pretty it's, it's pretty pretty it's pretty pretty <laughs> Dude, this color is killer i don't even know what it's called shad dawn so as you guys can tell it's got like it's got like a purplish glow on the top and it's got little speckles in it it's got a translucent bottom and also on the front of the head is chrome it's got like yeah. some pinkish on top this color is killer i kind of want to open it to see i saw this in my box um yesterday and i told Nora, i was like dude this bait just looks too good <laughs> For me not to throw it's been on my mind literally like all last night and i was like i just want to film a top order video freaking big boy let me lay this out in my hand so you guys can tell how big that thing is let's say look at the hooks on it more importantly yeah there's some big boys on that's there. exactly why i like six cents baits as well is the hooks on there guys are dude if that if that gets on fish man i mean he's got you He's got you. I had one of these in my finger last week, so I know, exactly <laughs> I know these things work, but that is a beautiful bait right there. Norm's going to be throwing the popper. I'm going to be throwing a huge walking bait. Now, let's listen to this thing, first of all. Oh, yeah, don't hook yourself. Dude, listen to that, bro. Is that not crazy? Wow, it's loud. I mean, this is like two just different baits. He's throwing the popper a little bit slower. This is going to be something I'm going to be walking the whole time on grass edges. We're going to try it. This is mainly used for like schooling bass. Who knows? We might see some come up today, but I'm mainly going to be working on the grass edge really fast to see if I can entice, you know, that big, big bass to come up and munch it. But that's the bait I'm going to be throwing. If you guys are wondering what I'm throwing it on, 
throwing it on the old mock smash. I can't wait for you guys to get some, uh, some of you guys to get your hands on these things because the price range of this combo right here is ridiculous. Fairly inexpensive and the way it casts is, I'm really impressed and I really can't say anything bad about it. But yeah, we're gonna tie it on this rod. I got it on 65 pound braid and we're gonna go from there. So yeah, lure on my rod, catch big bass, let's get it. All right, boys, we got the old mag dog one. I thought you just got hit freak me out mag dog 130 and shad dawn color this sucker is a big top water oh man oh there is grass everywhere first cast i'm messed up watch if still hit it listen to the noise of that thing that's gonna take a big boy to eat i'm gonna let you know now look at that grass that we're fishing today oh yeah for sure yeah <laughs> it's, it's almost done man i'm just one step closer, you know? You know what they told us in the Marines, you know, when I was deployed for nine months, you know how, can you imagine what it feels like that last, that eight months? You got oh, one I month know. left before you can fly back. Don't drop your pack, bro. That's yeah. what they told us. Don't drop your pack until you get, until you get back home. Okay, let, let me know when you come back. I know you got a lot to do there. They booked their hotels with creeks near them. We walk out in there and like wade. It only comes up to your knee or your shin. Oh my god, dude, dude, I just had like an eight pounder. I, did you right, see how fish. big that was? All right, bro, I'll call you back. That, right, <laughs> right, bye. 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 Bro, Norm, that was seriously like an eight pounder. Did you see how big it was? Oh my gosh. Norm, that was like an eight pounder, dude. I saw Oh. Holy sh dude, he came all the way out of the water. Guys, let me tell you right now, that fish was every, Norm, can you agree with me on that? That was every bit of eight pounds, dude. I've never caught a fish that big on a walking bait either. That was every freaking bit of an eight pounder. I have no idea how, dude, he, he put his whole body out of the water to get it and he just missed it somehow. Or he didn't miss it, he hit it, but he just never ate it. That was aggressive too. We haven't had a bite yet. I was on the phone and all of a sudden you just have one that big hit it. That's just, that is unbelievable. If we could start off with the freaking trophy, that's next level. Oh my God. He literally, I think he was just pissed at it. You know what I mean? I've been casting it down this bank for a minute and he just wanted to piss it off, like just slam it. Dang it, bro. <laughs> that was crazy. Come on, fish. Gosh, come on. Oh, that's spooked up. What in the heck? That had to have been a carp. If that's not, that's a 10 pounder right there. <gasps> Giant. Oh my God. It's like a four or five pounder. Are you kidding me? Why did he not eat it? He did the same thing as the last one. Went airborne for it, but just didn't commit. Like, you should just see this thing walk in the water in the loud clack. This is literally for the Giants, like 100%. I don't, I don't think I'll catch a fish under four pounds on this thing. I just don't even see it happening. There he is. Oh my God. I can't tell how big he is. I don't think he's that large. Actually, he's pretty good. He can be bad on the mag dog. I think I was gonna catch one that small on it. Mm. It's a two and a half pounder. Mm. Let's go boys. First fish today, he ain't what we had earlier. That's a solid two pound bass. Another one just jumped up. We need to get back in there. That's a beautiful two pound fish right here on this corner going back into this pocket right there on that grass, as you guys can tell. That's beautiful right there. Still a quality one, man. You can't complain about a fish like that. It don't work that way, guys. If you catch one like that, you just can't complain. I mean, I know I had like an eight and then one that was probably four to five pounds hit it. But, um, you know, we just got to keep chucking. That's how fishing goes. You just keep casting, you keep making it happen in hopes that you can catch a bigger one. If you guys were wondering about that swirl right there, that was a turtle, that was in the fish. So I want you guys to pay attention to something real quick. Right here on the edge of this bank, boom, look at that. Perfect parallel cast. 
that grass goes out about as far as I just casted. And look, we're covering everything in the strike zone if those fish are on the edge of the grass. So this is just the perfect cast. When you can get on the edge of the bank like this and throw parallel, you're just in the strike zone the whole time. And right now, these fish are roaming, chasing bait. So it's hard to really tell exactly where they're staging up. But one thing I can tell you is fish will always hang on the edge of that grass as long as it's there. Um, I don't care the time of day. I, I don't care any of that. There will always be fish that hang on that grass and hang right on the edge of it. Um, it's a perfect little ambush spot. It's a good, good little spot for a bass to hang out. And uh, something you always want to think about is staging up on these banks and fishing them like this because you're always in that strike zone. Another two pounder, <clears throat> two and a half. Mm, look at that. I can't believe ones this size are eating that. I can't believe that. We got our first fish today. Second fish today, what am I saying? Look at that. Look at the mag doll hanging right out of his mouth. You ain't the one we looking for, buddy, but listen, I can't complain about a two pounder. I was just saying it. I can't complain about no two pounder. That is a little fat, chunky, healthy bass. Man, if you guys keep biting, I don't care the size. They, they like that, man. That's fine. I do want to hook me a giant today after seeing those massive ones come up on it, but what a beautiful fish. Let's give you a little toss, buddy. Thank you for biting. Hit the like button for that one, guys. Oh, yeah, did a little trick shot. What I was just talking about literally two minutes ago was I was saying stage up on these banks to where you can cast parallel. There will always be fish hanging out on that grass line. And that's exactly what just happened, guys. You, you, you literally just witnessed it. I said it right before it happened. It didn't happen on my first cast. It didn't happen on my second cast. It didn't happen on my third cast. It's like my fourth or fifth cast, but I finally got bit. And so, you know, that fish could have been hanging out right here on the edge of that grass, or he could have been out there, and he just wasn't confident in eating this bait. So, you know, that fish probably could have followed the bait all the way out here, all the way up to my feet, and finally committed because the bait got close to the bank. So in a bass's mind, a bass is a predator, okay? A bait fish can run from a bass. So when a bass, uh, this bass could have been following that, like I said, all the way out there. And once he got right here, he noticed that he was in a corner. This bait was stuck in the corner, so that bass attacked right there. And that's those things that you need to pay attention to to catch more fish every day. You got one, biggin'? All the way on the other side of the pond. Come on, Norm. <laughs> Come on, Norm. Dude, he bit it all the way on the other bank. I cast it all the way over there, gave, gave it like one hard pop, and he just came up for it. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. Dude, that's like a three pounder. Yeah, there we go. Let's oh, go. Bro. Norm's on board. We were just talking about it. If he comes off, there's no way. Do you see how deep the popper was in his mouth when he came up and jumped? He ain't as big as I thought. Boom. <laughs> that's an easy two and a half pounder, Heck bro. Yeah, bro. Let's go. Norm's on board. Give me Give some. some yes, bro. sir. Heck yeah. When we first started this, dude, and, and we were throwing for like a while, and I was like, I yeah. just don't know if this is going to happen. And then all of a sudden, they that big one, up. and then Norm just got himself on board. Two and a half pounder. We can weigh him. But uh, I promise you that fish is two and a half pounds. You got those pliers? Yeah, I got you. So you caught him all the way on that bank? All the way on the opposite bank and just gave it one really hard pop and he came up for it. That was crazy. That is awesome, bro. He hit it like a freaking train. <laughs> Did he come out of the water for it? Yeah. It was They've been, crazy. dude, the ones that commit are like aggressive. I mean, even the two big ones, they were just, I can't, I can't believe that first bite, dude. That was the craziest thing. I was on the phone. All right. Please, this is the right skill, right? Yeah. It should be. I can convert it. It's like nine it. skills in <laughs> Noah's truck. Mine were both about two pounds. That's two and a half. Yeah, let's see. Oh, three. Three pounder. <laughs> hey, wow. three on the dot. Yeah, bro. he's a dense fish, man. He's got a little hefty body on he's him. He's pretty heavy, though. Yes, sir, Norm. Dude, three pounder to start it off. I mean, I say to start it off. We've been fishing for like 45 minutes, but I'll take it, bro. I'll take it. We're going to let her go. That's good. Get him back in the water, buddy. We're going to let her go swim another day. Oh, <laughs> What? Dude, I thought you were diving head first. <laughs> Your feet started to stumble. I yeah, was like, dude, these are some slippery shoes, baby. All right, you ready? Yeah. Come get close, dude. This could actually look. Talk about some B roll. Oh, there she goes. Oh, dude. Bye. Let's go, Norm. Norm. Bye, buddy. You on board, Bye, buddy? <laughs> <laughs> three fish today. Two two pounders. A three pounder. Let's two, two. get it. He said, he said two two. Two two. <laughs> Dude, I've had some mules come up and hit this thing, bro. They just don't commit. Yeah, babe, one up. I'm, about to, I'm about to try the popper over Dude, 
Dude, I was about to say, I. Oh, oh my gosh! Giant Norm. Dude, that was giant. The I've ever seen. All right, all right. Oh my god, he's. My hands are slipping. <laughs> Dude, get him. I mean, he's giant. Mega, mega, mega. That's a big one, bro. I got him in the side. <laughs> <laughs> just a four pounder with how fat he is and yeah a pound body dude that is crazy look at this look at how i got him in the head of that yeah there's a picture they're just swiping out they're so angry at it they just oh, come bro. up and swipe what you think about that bro dude that? <laughs> dude that is a football that's a freaking tank that thing bro nice I mean, just cremated it let's get away real quick all right we look got how fat his belly is <laughs> that's a big boy this is a four pounder. I yeah. promise you, this is a four pounder. Oh, let's go! <laughs> People make fun of me for getting excited, guys, but if you don't get excited over that. Why are you even fishing if you don't get you excited fishing, about fishing? Bro. Come on now. Why are you even fishing? He's probably four a little bit under it. Three and three quarters. Yeah. Three 14. Or no. Three, he's three pounds, 14 four. ounces, so two, two ounces, ounces off. Away. Yeah. I was about to say, he's like a three pound body, but. Just four pound fish. Yeah. Beautiful, man. Let's get him back in the water. Nice. Beautiful four pounder. That's what we were waiting on. I had an eight, knock it out. <laughs> I had another four to five, hit it. Catch a fatty like that. Look at the belly. Dude, he is big. All right. I'm gonna just give him a little. Give him a little drop. Oh. There she goes. Bro, how can you beat that? How you can't. Can you beat that? Smash that like button. Yes, Hit that sir. subscribe button, boys. Let's get back in there. All right, guys, we're gonna give this fish away real quick. Probably somewhere in that three pound range. He's skinny. Yeah. A little skinny body. Dude, that one, that slam, I've been cr thrown across the bank just working this thing yeah. as fast as I can, dude. <laughs> and they just hammer it. This one had it right on the bank. It was actually kind of cool. Oh. Let me see. Almost there. Oh, wow. This is a three pounder. Two pounds, 15 ounces. Heck yeah, Norm. One ounce away from that three pounder. So close. We'll call them three. Yeah. Wow, dude, you've caught two today on the popper, and they've both been yeah. three. <laughs> I've had some crazy nice. bites on this. This is awesome right here. That's freaking cool. That's what we like to see. We'll let her go. Yeah, she hit it like literally right there, I think. Really? Yeah, right was, at the grass line? Yeah, it was like super close. Good job, Norm. Yes, sir. There she goes. Oh, oh. She was, you see that? She's yeah. angry. We got two for Norm now. Let's get it, bro. Let's go, bro. I'm going to go back over on that point, man. I'm going to keep beaming. That I'm gonna mess around over here in this corner probably. Just do it. The heck of it. See the wind over there. So I'm, and this thing puts up like a splash. So yeah. I've been just, dude, hard as I can, just boop, boop, boop. They gotta be stacked. <laughs> <laughs> i